What's up, everyone? I'm hoping everyone's doing amazing today. Today, we're going to be showing you exactly how to post on Facebook. If you don't, I know it can be a little difficult sometimes when you have documents that are PDFs, but I'm going to show you exactly how to do it because you're going to need to post a lot in the Facebook group for our program so we can celebrate your wins and I can see exactly what you're doing. And, uh, you know, let's so let's go right into it. So I'm going to share my screen. So Dan, not going to call you out, uh, but just showing you as an example, Dan had a hard time posting in the Facebook group because he had a PDF. Now it's, uh, I don't think Facebook posts PDFs. So that's, that's probably why you're having a difficult time. So I'm going to show you what you would do. So you're going to download this and you're going to open this up. Okay. Now there's a couple different options that you can do. I just downloaded it. And what I can do is I can take a screenshot and how do you do a screenshot on a Mac? You go command shift four. Okay. And then you can, uh, just go and outline what you want to, to get a picture for of, and what it does is it grabs the picture and you're able to post those, but PDFs, it does not allow. So I'm just going to show you quickly. I'm just going to take a screenshot of your life plan. And, uh, there's, looks like there's three of them. You, um, you went and made your own. I would have, uh, instead of doing this, which is fine, uh, but I recommend not doing that because that probably took a lot of time. When you go to the life planner, all you guys have to do is uh, to print one off is to um, go here to share, download, download PDF print, and then um, you download it. And then it downloads the PDF and then you just go and click on the link and then you're able to print it. It's very simple. Um, so you just go live planner. We just downloaded it. So you're going to press print. That's it. Now, Dan, I see that you didn't, um, print yours, which is fine. I recommend writing it out because it's a, a little, um, uh, helps you memorize it more. But what you do is you create a copy of the, the one that this is the community one. This is the one everyone has. So it's, you're not able to copy it or, um, let's see, I actually have to delete these, but anyway, yeah. So when you print these off, um, this is like the one that everyone has access to. So you're definitely going to want to make your own copy so you can update it, change it. But anyway, so you would call this Dan's copy, right? Dan's copy. And then you can go in here, Dan, if you do not want to print yours off, you can just go ahead and add a text box and go ahead and just say what you want to say in here, right? It's pretty simple. So instead of having to make your own one, you could have done that, which is fine, but just for future reference. And then obviously you can save these uh, later and download them how you want. But anyway, going back to posting. Okay. I was just showing you guys that for the life planner, but going back to posting, um, we took screenshots. So what else can you do? So you, once you download it, you should be able to have it under uh, finder. Okay. So, oh, sorry guys, this is uh, in the way. So Finder, if you have a Mac, you're able to find what you downloaded, my life plan. And uh, so this is, this is Dan's. So we're going to click on it. So he has it as a PDF. So let's see if we can uh, download this and save it. We're going to go here to save as an image. We're going to see if that's a, a possibility. Let's see. So there's Word doc, JPEG. Okay. So JPEG means image. PNG is image. So we're going to save these as a, a JPEG. Let's see how that works. Okay, we're going to go in here, save it under desktop, save. And let's see if it did it. Okay, so it's a PDF now. Okay. So PDF again means, uh, I'm sorry, not PDF. It's saved actually as a PDF, which we don't we do not want. So let me, let me click on this again. It might be a uh, compressed file. Convert to Word, Excel, or PowerPoint. Save as text. Save as. Let's see. Microsoft Word. Convert to. Let's see. Convert to JPEG. Let's see if that will work. Okay. According to this, if it's a PDF, you need um. You need like an extra additional thing. So just to make this easy for everybody, how do you just screenshot it? Very simple. So what you do here is how to screenshot on Windows. It tells you exactly how to screenshot on Windows. It's uh, Windows key, 
print screen key together shows you right there. That's how you would do it. Now, the one most basic way to do it, if you want to be old school, which is totally fine too, take your cell phone, take a picture of the document, and then you can post the picture on Facebook. Okay. It's pretty simple to do that as well. Um, if you guys don't know how to do that, I can, uh, I can show you too. maybe comment on this video. If you're like, Hey, maybe show me how to post for my phone. But all you do is you take a picture with your phone and then you go to the Facebook app and then you upload it. So let's see if this works for Dan. We're going to go to Dan's. We're going to, uh, we're going to go to the Facebook group. We're going to post these screenshots for Dan. Let's give it a shot. Um, life Dan's at Dan life plan. Then I'm going to say, watch this video to learn, see what I do. Okay, so then you go over here. Sorry, images. You click on there. Then we have the three screenshots. Post. There you go, Dan. So next time you have trouble, I know you emailed me, but I think it's important for us as a community, as a group to see each other, what we want to accomplish and help each other accomplish it. That this, that's what this group is about. It's about helping people succeed and grow, love each other. So the more people can see what your goals are, maybe we can help each other get them. So hope that helps you guys see how you can post on Facebook if you don't know how to. Okay. Cause you're going to need to do this a lot in this, uh, in this program. Looking forward to your success. I'm here for you. Let me know if you need anything. Bye.